Clippers hosting the Spurs, and the Clippers are 12 and a half or 13 point favorites. The over under is at 233. The Spurs are plus 600 on the money line, while the Clippers are minus 900. These teams are trending in two different directions. The Spurs are on a three game losing streak, the Clippers are on a three game winning streak. Now, before you bet this game, go to Twitter go to Underdog NBA and see what players are actually playing in this game and use a site like VegasInsider.com. It'll allow you to compare all the casinos pricing so you get the best bang for your buck depending upon what side of this game you want to bet. Now head to head, the Clippers are on a three game winning streak against the Spurs. The Clippers are seven and three against the Spurs in their last 10 games against them. The favorite is six and four against the spread while the favorite is eight and two on the money line. The under is seven and three in their last 10. The under 233 specifically is eight and two and the road team is six and four in their last 10 meetings. The last game that they played, the Clippers won 131 to 126. They were seven and a half point road favorites. They did not cover. The game before that, the Clippers won 119 to 97 as eight and a half point home favorites. The game before that, the Clippers won 113 106 as three and a half point road favorites. The game before that, the Spurs won 101 94 as one and a half point home favorites. Now, most of these games have been decided by less than seven points and one game the spurs actually did get blown out they lost by 16 so that's food for thought in their last four games now in their last handful of games the spurs have not covered their last two games but they have covered five out of the last 10. they had a combined 217 264 257 and 204 points in their last four games and for the Clippers, they've covered their last two games. They've covered four out of the last 10. And we've had a combined 248, 210, 257, and 229 points in those games. Now, in their last handful of games, the Spurs specifically, they've lost by nine points, 20 points, 15 points, and eight points. So it's just a matter of what version of them is going to show up because the last time that they played the Clippers was a few nights ago and they lost by five. I'm going to take the Clippers with the money line. I'll take San Antonio getting the 13 points. And I'm going to go over in this game just because the last game they played went over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.